just a handful of sweets. <laughs> Spur of the moment thing. What sweets? Pick a mix. I was 12 and mum wouldn't buy them for me, so I just shoved them in my mouth and ran. I sugar rushed for about half an hour, and then when I got to the cinema, I threw up all over the man in front. Ruined the little mermaid for me. What are you talking about? Dan's a solicitor. A bloody solicitor, OK? I thought you said he dealt in property law. Yeah, well, the law is the law, so... I seriously don't think he'll care that you stole some sweets when you were 12. Yeah. Yeah, you're right, yeah. <gasps> I also stole a milk bottle from a milk float once when I was on my way home. I was thirsty and it was dark and... And it made me ill. Trust me. He won't be interested in your crap crime history. It's just a date. It is not just a date. It's a first date. You can't take back a first impression, you know. He asked you out, right? Well, no. He told Sue, the sodding receptionist, that he thought I was attractive. And so she organised the whole thing. But the point is, he likes you already. Exactly! Huh? He likes me. But he doesn't know me. He's going to have some kind of image in his head of, of what I'm like. He's going to think that I'm smart and sexy and funny and not all freaking out about this. I might be stating the obvious here, but I think you're overthinking this. Oh, he's super hot! OK, there, I've said it. He's super hot and way out of my league and there's no way he's going to like me. He's going to think I'm, I'm boring and awkward and not sexy enough. Look, he's a solicitor who deals in property law. Not exactly Indiana Jones. That's it, I'm not going. I can't go. I I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to send him a text and I'm going to tell him that my nan died. No, wait, what if he actually... No, I'm away on a long holiday. No, I'm sick. Yes, that's it. I'm sick and I can't see him because if I see him, then he'll get sick too. And die. Yes. <sighs> oh.